Today, we're going to go through a few steps to fix Roblox's error code 279ID equals 17 failure. This error code basically means that Roblox cannot connect to the specific game that you want to play. So let's go ahead and try and fix that. The first step is probably one you've tried already, but if you haven't, you should absolutely restart your device. Whether you're on mobile or PC or a laptop, it's important to give your device some room to breathe. Depending on what device you're on, these images on screen should help you learn how to restart. After your device comes back online, you should try joining the same Roblox game. If the error code still pops up, we'll move on to the next step, which is restarting your router. On your internet router, you should locate the power button and flip it off. Or you can also unplug the router altogether. Once the router's off, it's very important to wait a minute or two before you turn it back on. Once it's back on, you need to wait again for a few minutes just so it can reconfigure itself. Once it's back on, you should try joining the same Roblox game. And if it still doesn't work, then we can move on to the next step, which is try to join a different network. If you're on PC and you have access to an ethernet cable, that's definitely what you want to try. If you're on mobile and you have access to a hotspot of any kind, that's what you want to try. If you try either of those, join the same Roblox game to see if that fixed it. However, if you don't have access to an ethernet cable or another Wi-Fi network or a hotspot, then we can move on to the next step. To try and diagnose the issue, we can run a speed test. I personally recommend speedtest.net. It's a super simple platform that allows you to check your upload and download load speed. Once you make it on the website, it's as simple as clicking one button, the go button. Roblox actually recommends an internet speed of four to eight megabits per second. So if while you were running that test, your internet speed often dropped lower than those numbers, that means you need a different network or you need to try to limit the amount of devices that you're using on your network. If the speed isn't the problem, then it may be your browser. For example, if you're using Google Chrome, you may want to switch to Internet Explorer, Mozilla Firefox, or even Opera GX. If you try joining Roblox from a different browser and it works without the error code, that means that you should use this new browser to play Roblox from now on. If it still doesn't work, we'll go ahead and move on to the next step. Now this next step can only be done on a Windows computer. We're basically going to check our firewall and antivirus software. So let's go ahead and search for Windows Defender Firewall. Once we click on that app, we should get to this page and we should see allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall. Then what you need to do is find where it says Roblox. It should say Roblox Game Client and you need to make sure that Roblox Game Client is allowed on private networks. You can also check public if you're comfortable with it, but private is the one that you should really be concerned about. Additionally, for this step, you may want to try deactivating your antivirus software temporarily and try to see if that works. Some antivirus softwares also have a game mode that you may need to enable in order to play Roblox. If nothing in this video has worked so far, the final step is going to be uninstalling and then reinstalling your Roblox. A fresh start to the app is going to fix a lot of the issues that you're running into. And that's all the steps that I have for you today. I truly do hope that one of these steps resolved your error code and you're able to play Roblox again. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment if you would like. Bye guys.